Hello everyone. Let's solve this problem simultaneously. We have xy plus x equals 10 equation 1. Then x plus y equals 8. Our equation 2. Let us get our equation 3 straight away. Um, y is equal to 8 minus x equation 3. This one is from equation 2. So do not put it back into equation 2. Put it into equation 1, right? So equation 1 is x, y. So it's going to be x into 8 minus x because our y is 8 minus x then plus x equals 10 we open the brackets 8x minus x squared plus x equals 10 and like I always do I make sure that the one with the highest power appears first negative x plus x plus 8x is equal to 10 meaning that negative x squared plus 9x okay is equal to 10 now we multiply all through by negative 1 so this will turn to positive this will become negative x and this becomes negative 10 bring this to the left so we have x squared minus 9x plus 10 equals 0 now we have a quadratic equation okay so the next thing is what method do we use to solve this I suggest we use um, the formula method okay the most difficult thing about the formula method is remembering the formula our x is minus b plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a now what is our x minus b becomes minus minus 9 plus or minus because b is minus 9 plus or minus then we have b squared that will be minus 9 squared then minus 4 times 1 times c but our c now is 10 so let me turn this to 10 okay so we divide by 2 times 1 so now x will be equal to plus 9 because negative negative is positive plus or minus then we have square root of 81 minus 4 times 1 times 10 and that is 40 okay then we have over 2 to continue x will be equal to equal to 9 plus or minus then we subtract 81 minus 40 that will give 41 then we divide by 2 so we are saying that our x is equal to 9 plus square root of 41 over 2 or 9 minus square root of 41 over 2 okay so this means that we have two values of x okay from here but we'll also get the values of y so we'll get the corresponding value of y our equation 3 is y equals to 8 minus x right so now y will be 8 minus open bracket 
9 plus square root of 41 over 2. Close the bracket. And y will be equal to 8. We open this bracket so we have um, minus 9. Okay. Over 2. Then minus square root of 41 over 2. Yes. What I've done is to split this into 2. So we have um, negative 9 over 2, then negative root 41 over 2. You can decide to simplify this. So that's y is equal to, we have 16 minus 9 over 2, then minus square root of 41 over 2, right? Now our y is... 16 minus 9 is 7, so we write 7 over 2 minus square root of 41 over 2. This is the value of y when x is equal to 9 plus square root of 41 over 2. Right? Now, the next value of y, y will be equal to um, 8 minus x, right? But the x becomes um, 9 minus square root of 41 over 2. Okay, you can simplify this so that y is 8 minus open bracket 9 over 2 minus square root of 41 over 2. These are the same thing, right? Open the bracket so that y is 8 minus 9 over 2 plus, this will turn to plus, square root of 41 over 2. I want to find the LCM of this first. So y now will be this times this will give 16, then minus 9 over 2 plus square root of 41 over 2. Okay, so to continue, y will be this minus this is 7 over 2 plus square root of 41 over 2. So this is what we have for the value of y when x is equal to um, 9 minus square root of 41 over 2. Okay, by this we've come to the end. Thank you for watching to the end.